All right, you, you ladies ready? We're ready. Let's, Let's do ready. this. We're going to try a little experiment with this entire bowl of change that we have. Can you do me a big favor? Absolutely. It's very simple. I'm going to turn around. I want you to grab a handful of change okay. and hold it in a closed fist just like that and let me know when you've done it, okay? Okay. Got it? All right, do you have a handful of change? I do. Hold it in a closed fist out in front of you, okay? I'm going to turn around. You ready? Yes. All right, do you know how much change is in your hand right I now? I have no idea. I think I do. You do. I'm gonna try anyway, let's see. Uh, and uh, since this is deal or no deal, if I get it right, I get your phone number after the show. <laughs> deal or no deal? Deal. Deal. Excellent, <laughs> hang on to this so they know I don't cheat. Count it, see how much you grabbed. Dump it right here on the table. Count it to the penny. I got all quarters. I, all quarters, that's lucky. How much did you grab there? A dollar fifty. Now there's no way I could have known that. Do you find that weird? What? You have a dollar fifty to the penny. Yes. Hold out your hand. Okay. I'm gonna put the coin in your hand. I want you to squeeze it. Okay. Turn your hand like this uh -huh. and don't move. Now, you don't feel anything weird, do you? No. It's just a quarter sitting just in your quarter. hand. Just a quarter. When I go like this towards your hand, I want you to begin to rub the quarter between your fingertips. All right. And you're actually gonna feel it bend while it's in your hand. Shut up. Watch. Start rubbing it now. Do you feel it bending? Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up! You feel it, don't yes, you? Yes, I feel it bending! Stop! Ah. Let's take a look. Oh, I don't want to. Oh my god. <laughs> Hello. Hi. How are you? I can get inside my mind. I'm ready to get inside your mind. Usually guys get inside my mind. Try to get inside my mind. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, good night. Never mind. Let me explain before we go any further. This is the, right here, right now, is the first time you and I have ever met, correct? Absolutely. Okay, that's very important. You weren't asked to write anything down backstage, no. nothing sneaky. No. Uh, is, is, do you, is there an image in your mind you think you could draw? Anything? Yes? Do you have an image in your mind? I have so, one. Okay, I want you to think of it now. Okay. And now change your mind. All right. And now change your mind again. Oh, well, good God. All right. Okay, you've settled in on an image? Yeah. Cool. Step over here. We have markers, they smell good, but don't try that at home. Okay. I want you to draw the image right here. And by the way, it doesn't matter if your artwork is good or bad. Just draw it here, you have about 10, 15 seconds. And while she does that, I want you guys to check out a video clip of something I did about a month ago. Check this out. All right, guys, so uh, I'm here and my man Mike is about to ink up my arm. This is what you call an extreme prediction. And, and I think this officially proves my insanity. <laughs> Oh man, here we go. That's right guys. One month ago, I actually got a tattoo on my arm. What did you draw? <laughs> uh, what, uh, a yin yang. I just says hi mom. It, uh, but yeah, is that a, a yin yin yang. So is it possible to get into someone's mind and have any influence over their actions? Shut up, shut up. Here's your answer. Let me see. <laughs>